Hello everyone and I welcome all of you to online study for you a complete placement solution. Friends, our today's video is very, very important. I am going to talk about Accenture developer program and this is a golden opportunity from Accenture and you can understand the importance of this program that every student on LinkedIn is updating the certificate after completing this uh, Accenture development program, right? So you can go through this uh, LinkedIn, uh, you know, I will share the link. So you can see here every student is uploading that the certificate that sir I have completed this uh, Accenture developer program and definitely the recruiter will be scrolling through your profile in LinkedIn and they will come to know that you possess this skills and you have completed this kind of courses friends and this course you can complete only in two to three hours. So the beauty of this course is so within two to three uh, hours you will be able to complete Accenture developer program and you will be also getting the certificate now. So everything about this Accenture developer program, I will talk in detail. So please watch the video till the end. Also, if you have not subscribed to our YouTube channel yet, and if you have not clicked on bell icon, please do it right now. Otherwise, you will miss all these kinds of kind of internship update and uh, job updates and preparation. So I don't want you to miss even a single part of it. Okay, now, so let us come to the platform and see what exactly is this. So friends, the forest.com virtual internship. So many of you uh, complains that, sir, I have not done any kind of internship. So this is a small internship, you can say, because obviously in two to three hours, you cannot do a big internship. But here you will be able to learn a lot. And Accenture itself is telling that you will be able to use this uh, certificate. You can see. So use this experience. So once you complete the course, so use this experience on your resume in line with our policy. So if you're applying for companies like uh, Infosys, if you're applying for companies like Accenture, uh, if you're applying for companies like uh, Capgemini, Wipro, then you will be able to use this experience in your resume. And definitely, so this program, you will be able to learn many new things, okay? So here you can see what all basically you are going to learn here. So before that, earn a certificate. So when you complete the developer program, you will earn a personalized completion certificate to share with prospective employers and your professional network. Okay, now learn direct from the Accenture, gain real work experience. So basically you are going to get the real work experience. So it is not like the something will be only taught to you. So there will be also some hands-on experience will be there. Okay, and do it in your time. So whenever you are free. So for the developer program, in with your busy schedule, learn at your own pace and reach your personal goal. See, the enrollment is also very, very easy and that is completely free. So this Accenture developer program is free for all students. Okay, now, so you will be learning architecture, you will be learning programming, you will be learning testing, you will be learning security and you will be learning artificial intelligence. Okay, so everything has been given here. Also, in detail, if you'll see, so what will you do in this developer program? So define technical requirements. So you must have gone through the, uh, you know, SDLC, right? And you might be knowing also software development life cycle. So basically that, uh, you know, you will be able to learn that kind of thing. So define define technical requirements, understanding priorities and formulating measurable requirements. Okay, practical skills you will gain from working on this module. Okay, so technical requirement. And here you can see, take a quick look at your first task. So friends, everything is very, very easy. And definitely before that, uh, you need to um, register. But anyway, let us see. So I have just clicked on the defined technical requirements. So understanding priorities and formulating measurable requirement. If you come down, register now. And so watch video instruction. See, they have given everything in a very proper manner. So watch video instruction, get background info and context, get details for your task view resources to help you learn. So they will be also telling you what all resources you can use it. Okay. And submit your work on this page. So you are going to have a real world experience. That is what I will say. So get instructions for your task. So through the video lecture, you will be getting instructions to the course. And then here is the background information on your task. And then here is your task. So you have asked the client at digital healthcare. So to send you what new technical requirements they suggest having in addition to the existing ones, okay? And friends, trust me, there will be a great opportunity that Accenture will be also looking at your profile and you might also get hired, okay? Resources to help you with, so they have given your scalability. So all the resources, okay, whatever you utilize it for this particular task, okay? And then start your task. So register now to unlock the 
modal answer so everything is has been given here now so friends the next question is sir how to register so the enrollment or the register is very very easy so once you click on that okay then uh just let me tell you okay so now register now so you can continue with the google or you can sign up with the email now so once you click on continue with google then you will be redirected to this page okay so basically through your email it will be redirected so the first name is online study for you last name is a complete placement solution it might not take so i will just put placement okay and then uh, here i have given the current university college or other institution name and how did you hear about us so friends through instagram so on instagram also we are uploading lot of videos and people are coming to know from that and then complete registration so you will be asked a few questions based on that so if you will see you will come to know so let us see one by one okay so what is your current level of study or your highest completed level of study so you can mention here so undergraduate i will just go you know uh, the formal way i will select whatever so undergraduate okay bachelor degree so according to our uh, definitely uh, you know audience so what did you uh, how what did you start your current or most recent degree so i will just mention uh, 2018 okay so 18 to 20 to next okay so what year did you finish or do you expect to finish your current degree so i will uh, just mention 2022 okay so friends when you are filling this definitely they will have your details and that's what i was saying so they will be able to contact you from here so what is your major so i have just selected computer science if electronics and all is there then you can select others what gender gender you fill it carefully i always say you so it is male here okay and which racial uh, or ethnic group do you most identify with so uh, is there anything here okay i will just select uh, east asian okay so but when you are selecting please uh, select it carefully do you identify as someone with a disability so no okay what type of secondary school did you go now i am just going to fill it i don't want to waste your time so yes okay so yes definitely i don't want to waste your time so welcome to for is online study for you let's kick a start and from here your journey starts okay so view all the program so friends i will also tell you how can you i know search the program so view all the programs and time to time you will be able to search the program so uh, you have to go to the forage and then company you can see so whatever i was talking about so that is nothing but accenture nordics and accenture developer program okay now so you have to click over here and then you can see accenture developer program so already you have registered so enrolling you into the program because already you have enrolled okay now where did you hear about the accenture developer program so you can see uh, social media okay and what is the main purpose in registering for the accenture developer program uh, so i want explore or looking for further information i'm trying to figure out okay so here again friends i'm telling you so i am getting ready to start my career at accenture so definitely accenture will be also able to uh, you know filter out based on the information you are giving based on what you currently know about accenture so i am probably okay so i have already applied something like that okay yes okay enrolling you into the program so step by step each and everything i am telling you now so friends uh, definitely once you complete this then the next next will come okay let us start from here so again same thing is there and now here you will be able to see because start your task so you may only credit this task to your cv if you may get a genuine attempt at work practice or learning attempt so now from here we need to start your first task okay and once you will be able to complete this task then you will be moved to the next task okay so friends this is all about this accenture developer program and i have given you the complete idea and once definitely uh, you clear this task then you will be able to get certificate like this and please go and uh, put on your linkedin profile because now recruiters are more checking uh, your uh, you know uh, your linkedin profile so recruiters are there mostly on the linkedin profile itself so make your profile better make it visible to the recruiter and then you will definitely get hired okay and friends once again if you have not subscribed to our channel subscribe bhi kar lo and wo lal wala jo button hai usko bhi daba do because you will be getting all the updates from online study for you and that too before hai thank you all the best get the certificate and upload on uh, linkedin you can also tag us thank you